When you're building a brand new gaming rig, it is essential that you get all the right peripherals. And starting with a solid motherboard is exceptionally vital. When it comes to motherboards, you will need to get your research right, especially if you're planning to run with Intel's new 11th gen processors. At the beginning of 2021, Intel launched its cutting-edge desktop platform. This platform is principally designed to use within its Rocket Lake 11th gen processors. Intel officially transitions to PCIe 4.0 and the topmost SKU Core i9-11900K, apparently providing a massive leap jump in IPC performance compared to the preceding generation. The CPU obtains double bandwidth in this new chipset. As a result, it enables more hardware to benefit from the chipset simultaneously. Additionally, it makes a transition to DDR4 3200 support, a new pinnacle in a product line that was earlier DDR4 2933. The new motherboards pack in plenty of performance and thermal upgrades that have the potential to unlock the true gaming potential within you. After hours of research and after taking experts' advice, we have listed the top 5 best Intel Z590 motherboards to help you choose the one that suits you perfectly. The links for the products mentioned in the video are in the description below. You could also find a more detailed analysis and a comparison tool on our website, pickadvisor.com. Let's get right into our top picks. Number 5. ASUS Tough Gaming Z590 Plus The Tough series is ASUS's budget-friendly option which ensures durability. The Tough Gaming Z590 Plus Wi-Fi is one of the new models that support overclocking of the 11th generation Intel CPUs and also features PCIe Gen 4. But this version does not have all the options as compared to the ASUS ROG Maximum 8 Hero but it is going to get the job done for most people. The Wi-Fi version uses a wireless CNVI module and that is the only difference when compared to the non-Wi-Fi variant. It has a clean design with black armor and plenty of cooling on the chipset. As this is a budget-friendly option, you only get 8 plus 4 pin power connectors for the CPU. This can limit the amount of power that the CPU gets and the overclocking results that you get as compared to 8 plus 8 pin power connectors but you should still be able to get away with some decent overclocks on an unlocked CPU. As is the case with the Maximum, only the top M.2 slot supports PCIe Gen 4. The same is the case for the top PCIe slot which is reinforced for better GPU support. There are 4 DIMM slots on the board and it supports RAM speeds up to 4800 MHz. You can have up to 128GB of RAM on this motherboard with all the slots populated. The motherboard does come with an integrated I.O. shield. You get a single USB 3.2 G2 Type-C, USB 3.2 G2 Type-A, and two USB 2.0 ports. You also get an HDMI port and a display port. You also have your audio jacks. Number 4. Gigabyte Z590 Aorus Master If you're looking for an all-rounder high-end Z590 motherboard, then Gigabyte Z590 Aorus Master is the best of all. The motherboard offers great performance, has ton of features, has great build quality, and looks amazing. The board comes with 3 PCIe 16 slots, triple M.2 slots with thermal guards, supports up to DDR4 5400 MHz memory, and has steel reinforced RAM slots. The prominent features include Q-Flash Plus button that is for updating BIOS without installing the CPU, memory, and graphics card, Dual BIOS 7.5 WMK Thermal Connectivity Pads, Aquantia 10GBE LAN, ARGB and RGB headers, USB 3.2 Gen 2x2 support, Intel Wi-Fi 6E 802.11ax, 2T, 2R, and BT5 with RS antenna, 125dB SNR amp up audio with high-end ESS, Sabre 9118 DAC, shielded memory routing to avoid interface, optical S, PDIF out, pre-mounted IO shield and hybrid fan headers. The motherboard uses true 18 plus 1 phases digital power design and provides superior overclocking. The VRM MOSFETs are cooled by heat sinks with fin array design and copper heat pipe with direct touch 2 design for better heat transfer. It is a stylish and modern looking motherboard and the RGB LED lighting on it looks great. For display output there is one HDMI 2.0 and one DisplayPort 1.4 port as well. Overall a great high end motherboard that does not miss out on anything and is also very well priced. Number 3. Gigabyte Z590 Aorus Elite AX The Gigabyte Z590 Aorus Elite AX is one of the more affordable options available on the market. You still get the Z590 chipset along with other premium features but the pricing is a bit lower than other models here. The motherboard does have some weight to it and it looks pretty nice. It comes with plenty of armor and all the DIMM slots, as well as the top PCI slots are enforced. There are 3 M.2 slots but only the top 2 come with heatsink. The Aorus logo on the motherboard does indeed light up and the motherboard has other RGB lighting zones as well, all the things you expect to see on a high-end gaming motherboard. Other than that, you have that amp-up audio and 6 SATA ports for your storage. 
At the top, there are 8 plus 4 pin power connectors to provide enough power to the motherboard when overclocking. The motherboard comes with an integrated I.O. shield for easy installation. At the back, you get some USB 3.2 ports and USB 3.0 ports as well as Type-C port. You also get your audio jacks as well as 2.5G Ethernet, Wi-Fi connectors, and display port. Number 2. MSI MPG Z590 MSI MPG Z590 Gaming Carbon Wi-Fi is a higher mid-range motherboard that offers high performance, top quality, and has a lot of features. It is also a very attractive looking motherboard with modern theme design. The motherboard comes with 3 PCIe 16 slots with 3-way AMD Crossfire support, triple M.2 slots with heat sinks, and supports DDR4 5333MHz memory. The prominent features of the motherboard include Flash BIOS button, 2.5G LAN, Intel Wi-Fi 6 Plus Bluetooth 5.2, lighting USB 20G port, RGB lighting with ARGB header, SPDIF out port, and pre-installed IO shield. The motherboard comes with a 16 plus 1 plus 1 power phase design and has enlarged VRM heatsinks with a heat pipe for better thermal performance. It can handle any 10th gen or 11th gen processor with a mid to high amount of overclocking pretty comfortably. Display connectivity options include one Display 1.4 and one HDMI 2.0B port. The motherboard offers much more than its price and can give any flagship Z590 motherboard a tough competition. Number 1. ROG Maximus 8 Hero ASUS is known for making some of the best motherboards on the market, and here we have the ROG Maximus 8 Hero which is one of the higher-end models. You are expected to pay a bit more for ASUS products but you get those bells and whistles that you expect for the price. The motherboard comes with a couple of goodies such as ROG keyring. Also included in the box are all the cables, crews, and the cable ties that you are going to need for your build. This is the Wi-Fi version of the motherboard so it comes with an antenna to catch those Wi-Fi signals. Inside the box you also get a GPU support bracket to prevent GPU sag. This model comes in black but there are texture differences that make the different parts of the motherboard stand out. It does have a unique look if you're interested in showing off. The motherboard has a 14 plus 2 power design. It has 8 plus 8 pin power connectors for the CPU so you should be able to overclock your unlocked CPU pretty well. There should be no power delivery issues. There are 3 fans headers at the top of the board. Next to that you have the code display that is going to give you an error code in case something goes wrong. This should make troubleshooting a bit easier. You also get the power and reset buttons on the board itself along with addressable RGB headers. On the side, you get a pair of USB 3 connectors along with 6 SATA 6 ports. At the bottom, you have headers for your water cooling including the temperature sensors and the pump. There are 4 M.2 slots for PCIe SSDs but it is worth noting that only the top one supports PCIe Gen 4. This motherboard does have 6 SATA 6 port but two of them will be disabled if you're using all the M.2 slots. This is due to PCIe lane's limit. The motherboard has an integrated I.O. shield for easy installation and talking about the ports and connectivity options that you get on the back. You get clear CMOS and BIOS reset button. You also get a BIOS USB port that you can flash the BIOS without having to install the CPU. There is an HDMI port if you need it. You have the Wi-Fi antenna connections at the back as well. You get plenty of USB 3.2 ports but you also have some USB 2.0 ports if you need them. There are audio ports at the back which do light up so that you know what you are looking for in the dark. For building a powerful system with a mid to high end Intel 11th gen and 11th unlocked processor, it is better to go with the Z590 motherboard because it offers better performance, features, and supports overclocking. The correct motherboard has the ability to deliver the best performance during all of your high octane gaming sessions. Apart from the specs and features, you also have to see whether the selected motherboard fits in your current PC case. However, getting the best Intel Z590 motherboard is quite challenging when you have plenty of models available on the market with a decent design and innovative features. All the products mentioned above are a perfect blend of versatility and innovation, providing the users the best in class experience. Choose wisely which products you see the best and will fulfill all your requirements. Let us know in the comments which model works for you the best and why. Thank you for watching the video, and that is all for this one. If you find this video helpful in any way, give a huge thumbs up, stay tuned for the upcoming videos by subscribing to our channel. See you guys in the next one.